Uh, yeah, it, it, not bad. I mean, we're looking ahead to Father's Day weekend around here and uh, boy, it looks great as of right now. I mean, we've got lots of sunshine forecasts and temperatures not too hot, not too cold today on the chillier side still, but 68 is not chilly. You get in the sun, it feels 10 degrees warmer. We're feeling like the 70s, but 68 was our official high at Hopkins. Our average this time of year just to kind of level set everybody's at 80 degrees and notice the precip. We had almost a half an inch at Hopkins again last night into this morning. We're drying things out nicely, though. We've got mainly clear skies. We're back into the 40s for some of you inland, 50s in the city tonight as the skies clear out and we re relax those winds a little bit. How much rain fell over the last 24 hours? Look at Geauga County and eastern Cuyahoga County picking up a little localized one to two inches of rain. There was a cell that just sat there. Most of us a quarter of an inch to three quarters of an inch heavier amounts you get down towards the south as well. If we go back to Sunday and put it all together, we're talking a widespread two to four, even up to five inches of rainfall as you get down towards the south up to an inch. All of it was needed. And where does it put us in terms of numbers? These numbers just came out over the last hour. We now have a two inch surplus in Cleveland. That is amazing compared to where we were last week. Akron, that's not bad. And Mansfield, not bad being about a half inch below average. Our ground is happy. So where do we go from here? Low pressure outbound, big picture across the country, severe weather to the south. There's the system out towards the west. For us, our attention turns to the north. Doesn't look like much, but this is a system diving down to the south. The water vapor shows a very notable swirl there heading south. That is a piece of energy in the atmosphere that's going to punch into our environment tomorrow and create some thunderstorms. I think some of which could be on the potent side. National Design Mart Hour by our forecast keeps us cool tomorrow morning. We'll start with clouds or we'll start with sun. We'll bring in the clouds. We go through the midday hours. A couple scattered showers out in advance. This is your newest model run, and this is exactly what I was thinking was going to happen. Remember, it was all scattered over the last couple hours. I think we get a line of potent storms in here tomorrow evening that sinks from northwest to southeast. Then we'll clear things out with some lingering showers around. But again, we'll have to keep an eye on some of those storms. I'm not seeing a lot from anybody on that. The other thing coming back in our forecast is a little bit of atmospheric smoke from those same fires up towards the north. That comes in here Friday. Day. Nothing surface based, but we'll have that hazy sky back in the area. Union Hill Mortgage seven day forecast. Father's Day weekend. Saturday looks great. Sunday looks awesome, too. We bring back rain chances into Juneteenth and then on into Tuesday and Wednesday. Some showers and thunderstorms return.